Well, according to the CDC in the United States for children ages 5 to 14, drowning is the second leading cause of injury and death. That number is even higher for ages 1 through 4. But your children can't get free lessons if they don't know how to swim. Jessica Knox is live from Liberty Lagoon in Baton Rouge to tell you how. Jessica. Reggie, Vanya, I was just speaking to Breck and they tell me their ultimate goal is to make sure that they can help as many children in the community um, how to swim. I'm standing here now with Jason, the president and CEO of Baton Rouge Art Gallery. Tell me, how are you feeling this morning, Jason? I'm feeling great. It's a really nice morning. Everything looks great and uh, it's a good day to get in the water. Now, I understand that the reason why you guys are doing it this week, because of the history here in Baton Rouge, um, 60 years ago in 1963, there was a, a swim-in or a sit-in. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, July 23rd, 1963, there was a group of about 30 to 50 black activists who approached City Park Pool, which at the time was a 20,000 square foot massive uh, public pool, but obviously I say public, it was a segregated pool. Uh, so the activists that approached the pool were barred from actually getting into the water, but it was a protest against the segregationist policies of the day. Uh, and now we're at the 60th anniversary this month, and we've got a great exhibition over at the gallery inside of City Park in the spot where the swimming happened uh, as a result of the partnership between Baton Rouge Gallery, Breck, and uh, Dialogue on Race Louisiana. Now, we all know that um, history there is what led to so many people of color not being able to swim mm -hmm. today. That's what you guys are trying to change yeah. here with this free swim camp that you guys are offering. Tell us a little bit about that. I understand that they still have time to register. Give us um, some details. Yeah, up until 8 a.m., you can go ahead and register for the lesson. Uh, it's been a wonderful thing that Breck's been offering to the community since 2019, these free swimming lessons. Uh, you mentioned the, the statistics around uh, black Americans and swimming uh, black children in America are actually five and a half times more likely to die in a drowning incident than their white peers. And hopefully a, a day like this, lessons like uh, the ones that, are, that Breck is offering can help uh, reduce that statistic. All righty, well, stick around because they're going to teach me how to swim here this morning. So grab your floaties, grab your swims, and we're headed to the pool. Reporting live, Jessica Noss, NBC Local 33 News. All right, thank you, Jessica. Some very good information there.